So grass silage contributes a significant amount to the annual feed tonnage and this can be up to 30%. So it's important to maximise um, the quality of this forage, particularly in a year where there's supply chain challenges and inflation in terms of costs. This will lead uh, for some farmers chasing bulk rather than quality to counteract the increase in costs. So higher DMD improves dry matter intakes, uh, performance in terms of live weight gain or milk solids, and also reduces uh, concentrate requirements. And this also can have a positive effect on rumen health. So it's important to uh, find a balance between maximizing dry matter yields and quality. Where high DMD silage is required, for example, for winter herd milking cows or spring calving herds, or for finishing, plant to cut between mid and late May to achieve DMDs of 75% and greater. Grass quality reduces rapidly um, per week after the heading date by between 2 to 3% DMD. For good silage preservation, um, the cutting date is important in terms of uh, grass quality. The level of sugars in the grass should be uh, greater than 3%. Nitrates also play an important role. Uh, in terms of buffering capacity. So this should be between no more than uh, 600 to 800 parts per million. It's also important to uh, try and achieve a dry matter greater than 28% to optimize preservation of your silage. If conditions around silage cutting are poor, um, for example, poor weather, low sugars or high nitrates, silage additives should be used to increase your D&D of your silage. With current costs of silage production of 47 euro per tonne, it's important to maximise silage production through good management. Losses can have a uh, significant cost, so with an average loss of 16% can result in a cost of 3,760 euro per year in a standard pit of 500 tonne. In addition to these losses, um, a reduction in grass quality can also increase your feeding costs. To offset the reduction in grass quality uh, of 5% DMD results in feeding 1.5 concentrates per day per cow, resulting in a cost of 490 euros per week for 100 dairy cow herd in winter milk with current feed costs. With increase supply chain ch challenges and high inflation, it is important for farmers to maintain their self-sufficiency as much as possible. Therefore, it's important to aim for high quality grass silage to lower the concentrated feeding requirements of your herd. Once you open the pit, it's important to get your silage tested to know what the quality of your silage is to be able to plan ahead and supplement accordingly. For more information, please contact your local Glambia representative, local branch, or visit glambiaconnect.com.